Hello awesome people, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to Software Inc. In the last episode we uh, we talked about the legend of hip, well the legends of hip, um, which is uh, our simulation game in, in development. I also talked to you guys about my plans for the immediate future of this series, which was hire new teams, invest the money we have, um, hire new people, build the new rooms, and start working on another product you know, at the same, in the same time as time and space, so that we can uh, hopefully release two products instead of one every few years, uh, and hopefully that will investment will pay itself back into actual profit uh, later on, so that we can increase the speed of which we work towards our hardware factory, um, which is basically the thing we're doing right now. Uh, I will, of course, show you all around, but before we start, I have two new people to invite to our company. Um, those people being. And I have to search because there's a lot more people now. Ah yes. Uh, let's start with actually no. Let's let's start. Let's not start with let's start with Isaac because otherwise I have to scroll in my um, in my Discord uh, quite a bit. Quite a bit. Um, where was the other person I wanted to add in? Here he is, Arya Man, former designer, now programmer. You wanted to be a programmer, um, and here you are. Welcome to the company. You had a little backstory too, which it was. After working at Hipbone Inc. for what the CEO calls a season, I don't know why, uh, and sucking at designing, I am going to program again, but no one will hire me. Because they don't trust I'll stay as a programmer. Almost as if it's scripted, Hipbone Inc. is the only one willing to hire me. And there you go. You're in. <laughs> I don't need much convincing, do I? Uh, no. Uh, it's, it's funny that so many people of you are... Um, yeah, getting the fact that you, we have multiple seasons now where people were already in that same company, they use the same uh, the same person and then weave that, that those backstories together in, in this type of stuff, which I think is very funny. I think it's very cool. Um, so good on you guys and welcome to the company. Uh, and the other person, and now I need to start scrolling down. There we go through the entire list. Ah, there we go. Okay, so uh, we're probably zoomed out a lot now, but we will fix that later on. Uh, the other person that has joined is Isaac Powery, the PJ leader. Now, PJ doesn't stand for pajama in this one. <laughs> it stands for project management uh, because you wanted to be a project management leader. Um, and yet a little backstory too said, tried making company work. It failed now. He has joined your company to bring it to greater heights than before. I'm going to take a sip of my drink. Sorry. Ah, yeah, a little, little bit of a, a tickle in my throat there. Uh, but yeah, welcome to our company and hope you can take it to greater heights than ever before. Um, because you are, the, you are going to be our new kind of product leader. You have two stars in automation. Three stars would be ideal. Um, but for now, we will train you towards that. Uh, you still have four points left. Uh, leadership is a, is a skill that's not hard to train. So whenever you get training, you probably get one in HR because I'm lazy. Uh, <laughs> and then the extra one in automation so you can be one of our project managers. Um, probably at that point we will have two. We will have you, Isaac, and we, are, we will have Techie Guy um, of the Dev2 team, I think. Techie is also skilled in this. Yeah, he has full automation already. So you guys can lead the projects that we will have going then, and then we will, you know, manually do our hardware projects at that point. And um, that's, that's the goal in the future. But let me get back in. Actually, let me get back into my recording software first. There we go. Lose the sound for just a sec, but we're back. Uh, and let me talk you through about what I did. Uh, and we can do that whilst we're we're speeding along through the game, I guess. So one thing I noticed that, hey, we can now change the color of these chairs. Now, maybe this was already in there for a long time. I just didn't see it. Um, I can show you guys this. When you go into here and you want to build a chair, you now have this style option. I noticed that this was there before with some other stuff, but I didn't see that the chairs had different colors too. I, probably I just missed it. But, you know, I, I found it out and I thought, you know, that's some, that's some nice stuff to put in the meeting room. Just some red chairs instead of the, the yellow ones we have in the actual working offices. Um, so an immediate change here also. We went for this, uh, this little office here. Uh, there's no people in yet because they will come in next month. I just, I'm, I'm just famous with hiring all of the people and then I just wanted to jump back into the game um, and record this for you guys. So next month we will see people in here. This is going to be part of the, whoops, of the Def 1 team too. So uh, that, that's a weird thing, Dev1 team too. But this is another office for the Dev1 team. So these guys will all work on the same product. 
Um, which also means that the Dev2 team is not necessarily needed to help them anymore. Uh, the Dev2 team is the, the, the basement team. Let's just call them the basement team. Um, and uh, that, that means that these guys are now opened up to... Uh, I have to pause here, actually, because otherwise my people will be sitting there doing nothing. We have to set up a project for them. Um, but they will be there doing not a lot, actually, um, based on a lot of different things. Um, so Dev2 team will probably start helping the Dev3 team, and I will explain you why a little bit later. But that's what we did. We, we basically just leased this little bit there, and, and that's it. So let's go up. Now, over here, <coughs> sorry, over here we have another meeting room with the nice bright red chairs. Uh, the, the glass table didn't really fit in here, like I was complaining about the last time we built it. it. It doesn't really fit in many rooms, like this, this is already kind of almost claustrophobic, but I think it still works. Um, and it still looks quite cool, I think. Uh, then we have the two lounges, so two lounge rooms for people to just chill in. They have their water coolers, their snacks machines, and the little espresso machines. Um, should be fine, should be good for them to just chill out. And they can be used by any team. Then we have these two. Now, if we go into the overlay, we see that this is a Dev3 room and a Design Art 2 team. So, I made another Design Art team because I think, you know, we have two products, uh, two projects going. One of them is already uh, working quite hard on, on this one. Um, what we could do for now is we could just assign this to you too so we can help this move along and then these guys this is the dev3 team as you can see there's only six people in there i'm gonna take another super wedding sorry hmm. 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 <laughs> okay <laughs> jesus i didn't actually make myself cough with fake coughing um but yeah these guys have only six six programmers in there uh, compared to the team that they're working together with, which is also six designers slash artists. So probably it's a good thing to, as an extra help, have the Dev2 team work here with them, basically. I think that's the best uh, way of doing this. Also set up all the teams over here, so no need to worry about. Um, they don't have a task yet, but we can give them a task soon enough. Um, let's just take away the Dev1 and Dev2 team there, because they don't really have anything to do there anymore. Active users is going down, which is not good. Uh, I think I will. I think I will start working on this so we can actually move it forward. You know what? What I'm going to do is I'm going to set up the new one too because the thing here is uh, we're going to do this manually for at least one one product. The thing here is there's only one person now working. Now I know that in my Design R2 team I have some more 3D at least two stars, so they should be able to help out here, but. Up until that time that this that that little bar is full, uh, is full, the other guys won't do anything because they can't work on that feature. Now, if I open up the design for the next product now, I can just make them both work on it, uh, which is not ideal, but it's kind of how it goes now. So our next one will be, uh, what is easy to build and quite fast? I think an antivirus would be easy to build for us uh, since we have enough knowledge for that. It's not hard to do, and it's always a market that if you can get into it, it's it's it can make you a lot of money in a, quite an easy way. So we're gonna set that up. Um, so this is gonna be Hip Defender. So I'm very sorry, um, <laughs> Stealth, but yeah, it's gonna be Hip Defender. Uh, it's an antivirus, and we will start working on all of this. So I feel like. Market targeting. Oh, this is actually market targeting now. Wow. That is, ooh. That's an application scanner to make that a bit better. Uh, let's do a 2D interface with malware. And we're getting a lot of wasted interest. Well, not a lot, but it's, it's at least a bit. Networking. I'm not going to work on networking. Well, actually, we could do basic networking. We could do it in, put it in there, and not really add any features, or maybe like anti-spam or some. Well, no, that that the waste goes up so high. IP filtering the waste goes up. Expected interest doesn't go up. Port blocking. If I think this is what we do, okay. Um, price will be like uh, let's not go like very very like low on the price to to, to penetrate that market basically, um, and get in there. So the 2D editors, uh, tech level, highest tech level available. 
Even though it can support our thing, it's fine. Print Pro 5, it is great. It, okay, yeah, let's look at that one. Add it to, uh, oh, we don't have a lot though. Uh, can add it to. You seem quite good, so there we go. And I know the music is gone. I will get it back. If I click on it now, this will, I think this will be gone. So we have to do it all over again. Um, this will be 100%, I think. Yeah, awesome. I think this actually starts to make more sense now too because of the, the targeted marketing. Analyze, what does the analyze button do? Market saturation. Lower is better. Ah, so we're basically saturating the market now with monitoring a bit with this product. Passive protection is, is doing okay. And with active protection, we are actually doing quite well with the saturation. So there's actually, I think now a reason to change up this stuff. And there's an auto balance button. Okay, yeah. If we do this, what, what does it say now? Mostly the same, actually, I think, which is fine. But it's still 100% interest, 14 ways to interest. That's not that much. This is new to me. This is, uh, this is new to me. I haven't seen this since the last time I recorded. Now, do bear in mind that during every recording session, there's about a week in between. So it might be one or two small updates. Um, less than a year. Ooh, that, that's really good, actually. But that's if we work on this with all people, which is not the case. You will work on it and you and you will work. It still says less than a year, which is very good. Okay, let's develop this uh, this bad boy. Let's develop this bad boy. Okay, cool. Now we will see the um, the strength of our company hopefully coming up. Uh, let's get my music back before I get, you know, insane from the silence. Uh, <laughs> uh, and let's move on. Let's actually. I could have also actually give them the design deal. I'm thinking now, but I think this would be way more beneficial in the end. Um, how are we doing server-wise? Are we still balancing this out? It's it's going up like slightly. It was 10% last time I checked. I think it was it's 11 now. So distribution, yeah, it's right around that 3,000 still. That's good. I um, also need to check how much we are now paying for. I think we invested like 300,000 to rent all the rooms, build all the stuff, and then hire all the people last month. I think that was um, what we did, kind of. Um, we see that back. Hills, repairs, yeah, construction a lot. Our salaries went up, but not even by that much. But here it is, yeah, that, those are way higher salaries. Yeah, okay, so we are going up, which is a natural thing to happen, of course, now. So, we're still making money, though. Oh, that's the start of the month, isn't it? Yeah, it's the start of the month, so yeah. So we are losing money now, per month. For now, at least. That's fine. Uh, ooh, I can be trained. Awesome. I will be educated in... How many do I have left? Three points. Let's do... Oh, let's do 3D. Not sure how, how relevant 2D is still going to be. I think it will slowly push out, but I feel like there will always be things that you have to have 2D programming and art and design for. Um, I believe. So, yeah. We're working on both now. Um, let's say that this has the higher priority for now. This is more important to finish the design. And then this one, you know, we can design this with... And we just take these guys off. And when the art is done on that one, they can help here if this is not finished yet. And otherwise, they're just going to do design deals. I think that's going to be the play. Um, yeah, we're losing some money now. But like I said in the last episode, I'm hoping that this investment will result in the fact that we will gain more money in the end and faster. Um, I mean, we need products on the market, right, to actually sell them, basically. So our marketing team is, we're still making a small profit, but it's like, it's not a lot. And that's worrying me, to be honest. We don't have a lot to port it to. I think we can't really port it to anything. I think at this point, it's not worth it to market it anymore. Um, because we won't be selling that much extra because of the marketing. We're basically just throwing money at it and hoping that it will work. I think we just have to accept the fact that we have probably um, made a little mistake in the design of this. Even though it's an outstanding product, we just don't have the um, you know the people that actually are willing to, to buy this. We might even change the price to like 75, go down and see if that has a positive effect on the amount of stuff that is sold. The good thing is there's still no refunds, so it is actually a good product. Um, 
But the bad thing is, yeah, that, that it's it's not like doing whatever we wanted it to do. Um, but for now, we are also trying to get into other markets, which is one of the main things now. Trying to find that market that really suits our teams, I guess. Maybe the audio tool actually doesn't really suit our team, and that was kind of also uh, also a problem. Could be. Could definitely be. We have only only a support one here. Yeah, okay, that's good. Um, so that could definitely be a thing. What, what we could do now, actually, is now that we're waiting and we don't really have a marketing thing to do, and we also don't really have a support team, uh, a support thing to do, we could try and get, and boost our reputation a bit, gain a little bit of extra money by checking these guys. Uh, well, actually, we could also do hosting, I think. Um, so let's go for this. So hosting, hosting, we can take all of them. Uh, wait, on which server? We only have one server, so no. Okay, well, I'm, I'm so used to having multiple servers uh, for different stuff, but I, this just should be easy. This will boost our reputation quite a bit, um, but we have to take, keep an eye on this. So I'm going to keep this open for now. I don't forget. Uh, design, no, not right now. Marketing, I mean, marketing, we just have a very small team, so I'm not sure. Um, virus filter 5, I mean, no. The good thing is that it's a small thing, so it's a small antivirus, um, probably, but it's also a, uh, well, actually, we could take their money, even though they are they are a competition for us. But is there a smaller deal here? Because we don't have the huge support team, too, that another antivirus. So basically, anti-crime trap choker or virus filter 5. Um, let's, let's take a look at them. Um, category antivirus. Oh, wait, sorry, type. Antivirus. Uh, okay, so it was the newest one. Virus filter 5. Wait, that has released quite a bit. Oh, they don't have a lot of active users, actually. And what was the other one? Do I still have it open? Uh, support. Virus filter 5. Um, so what is that? Till when? September 2002. I mean, that's right now. So let's reject that one. Um, the other one was anti-crime trap choker. Okay, that, that I think was a quite a new one. So let's get this back. This one. June 20, 2002. They have, they have quite a, quite a, quite some active users and it is going to be right spread. Uh, they're going to sell quite a lot. I don't think we can keep up with this with our small support team and that will hurt our reputation so no sorry we're not gonna do that um let me just see some i wish you could see the active users right here that would really be handy actually these are just oh uh, well maybe no support then Marketing, what's the goal here? Budget per day, 14,000. We should be able to reach that. Um, but I'm not sure. The marketing, I think the marketing deals were a bit weird. This is 11,000, which is easy to reach. 12,000, but for... Ooh. I think we could do this one. Uh, sorry, this one. We're gonna try this one and we're gonna see. So marketing and the deal was, let's say 13,000, 13,000. We will go uh, we will go like 13,000, 13 and a half thousand, a little bit over to make them happy. And let's see if we can make this work. So the budget, we can set a little bit of a higher budget. There we go. Just to make sure, can we actually change that? I'm not even sure we can change it. Okay, let's keep an eye on this whilst we're going. So let's move on and, and see if the load gets way too high. Probably not though. Hosting is not that big of a deal. In most cases. Uh, also need to keep an eye on the actual deals here. To see if they're happy with us. So I think we will only see that after a year. So let's get the service back on. Servers are fine. Servers are fine. Okay, good. Now, we just have to see if they're happy with us. So performance for the hosting is all, all good, which is fine, which is nice. That's just extra money. I mean, the Framex one we can just develop right now. We don't really need it anymore. 
Um, there we go. It's still NA. It's still not available. Apparently. We kind of have to keep an eye on this then. Because our marketing team can do that. They can definitely reach that goal easily. It's like half of the day and they're already done. So at least they, we give them something to do. The support team, I'm, I'm a bit scared of messing up our reputation. Our reputation is growing though by the hosting. That's very good. Um, what do we have? Okay, I'm not really willing to scroll down to that. Okay, another digital distribution deal. Awesome. That's very good. Oh, that went up by like 3%. Probably not for only that distribution deal. Probably also due to hosting, but that's good. It's extra money. It's extra money. Um, actually, we made a profit last month. Distribution went up. Um, it's not that, that big. It's not like a huge profit, but it's good to have a profit. Definitely. Um, this is going slow. But yeah, actually, we're going to like an eight priority on that one. This is, doesn't really have a high priority. We can easily like very fast make this one. It's it, at least that's what the thing said. Um, so I think we should be good there. But uh, yeah, let's just check one more time if they're happy. It's They're not saying anything about a performance. Well, okay. Um, that being said, this is going to be the end of the video. Hope you guys are still enjoying it. If you do, please make sure to leave a like to show your support and to help the channel. And if you're not subscribed yet, then make sure to subscribe to help the channel out again. And also to not miss out on a single episode, of course. As always, I've been Hibbon. You've been yourself. Thanks for being awesome. And thanks for watching.